Hello. Yesterday I talked about step one being powerless over gambling and how your life can become unmanageable. We look through how you often gamble so your last pound is gone, how you long gamble longer than you planned, and how you gamble to escape worry and trouble. And how it manifests itself in the unmanageability is a decreasing in ambition and efficiency. It was making your home life unhappy and difficulty in sleeping patterns. And that's the impact for a problem gambler. And if that is the case and you want to do something about it, then you become powerless. And if you're powerless, then the solution Comes power. Step two, as I said before, has been written different from other fellowships. Step two says, came to believe that a power greater than ourselves could restore us to a normal way of thinking and living. And as I said before, it says restore. So restore means it's getting something that wasn't there. So your normal way of thinking and living wasn't there. And we're after a power. So you come to believe that a power greater than yourself could restore you to a normal way of thinking and living. And I've wrote power of the group. A lot of people um, may choose God. They may choose higher self. They may choose Jesus. They may, they may choose whatever they want. But any sort of power is greater than yourself. And it's come to believe. Came to believe is, is, is like, like, like you will and, and it, will, um, it will manifest itself. You don't have to believe in something right now. And uh, it will become more apparent and more clear when you go through the, the, the future steps and as far as to say that, that in step four you get rid of the old power the guilt, the shame, the remorse this power was a negative power that kept you in that cauldron of non-entity and that's the power we're going to replace with this new power so you just come to believe and, and what makes it most more significant of coming to believe in the group, the power of the group, because there are people within a Gambler's Anonymous group that can share their experience of what their gambling was like and what happened, how they got to the meetings. And more importantly, the fruits of what's happened since they've been to the meetings. Not just the, the numbers of the abstinence days, but what's changed in our life? Interactions with family, um, progress at work, um, eating more healthily, doing more activities, going on holiday. The list is endless. And they can be the shining example and they can be a power. Until you access your own power, they can be a power and that can work. And as far as like going through the, the, the rest of the, the 10 steps, so step two, came to believe that a power greater than ourselves could restore us to a normal way of thinking and living. So stay tuned for step three.